for us coming here for this one day series, uh, we've got to impose ourselves on the series right from the start. That's what it's all about. We have to get off to a good start and then hopefully keep some momentum right the way through the series. Is this going to be a good chance to, I guess, play against each other again in the one day series? You know, it's only a five match series, which is good. You know, look, uh, last year we played them in a seven match series. Um, you know, look, I, I think both teams played pretty well last time, but uh, look, you know, England up, won up on us in the 2020s, so, you know, we just got to keep playing consistent cricket. How much psychological effect will that 2020 final have? Do you oh, are they going to be detrimental to us? You know, look, um, no, seriously, oh, look, you know, look, they, they played well, they deserve to win. Um, you know, but, you know, a lot of those 2020 players, they're not here in this one day series, so it's, you know, look, I think it's just part and parcel of the, there's three formats, so look, you take confidence whatever, whenever you can win. I've never been a big believer in um, you know, winning a one-day series and having a test match you know, just after. I don't think much carries over. You've got a lot of change over players from one form to the other. Uh, the one-day series here is a long time before the first test match in, in late November. So you know, we'll be doing everything in our power to win and, and, and win well and play the best cricket that we possibly can. But as far as carrying over to November, I don't think it'll have much effect at all. We've got uh, you know, a few new guys actually in the one-day side that weren't here last time. Um, every one of our bowlers, I think, uh, is a new bowler to English conditions. So uh, I think we had Lee, Johnson, um, Siddle, those, and Hilfenhaus, those guys here for the one days last time, and we've got a completely new attack this time. But the guys that are around now have, have done really well for us actually since they've been in the setup and, and have adapted to, to international cricket like they've been playing for, for a number of years, which is a great sign for the team. I hope we're just to the game at the moment, but uh, yeah, obviously a fast bowler and, and just try to use the bounce, probably my main, main weapon as best I can. And beyond you know, those English wickets, obviously, have been talking to the other fast bowlers that have played here, uh, keep it a bit fuller probably most of the time, and, and yeah, here's the conditions. Every Every game you play against them and if you do well it, it puts your name up there. I'm not really thinking too far ahead at the moment. Obviously you've got these five games coming ahead and, and hopefully I'll get a chance to play in a few of those and, and put my foot forward for, for a chance to play in the Ashes as well. These young kids that are coming through, you know, look, they, they've been in the state system now for a few years and they're used to playing at that.